So, um, in regards to finances in the moment right now, the big thing kind of going on is COVID. COVID-19, a lot of the calls that I've been getting have kind of been in regards to what should I be doing during COVID? Is it safe? What's the market like? What do you suggest? And so I kind of try to keep it basic around the three Bs. Um, the best three things you can be doing right now. Um, budget, balance, and breathe. And I mean that literally and physically, uh, literally and figuratively. Take right, some time to inhale and exhale. Because one, not being able to breathe properly is a sign that the respiratory system could be in distress. <laughs> which could be a sign of COVID. So every day I implore you all to let's take a deep breath and try to hold it for 10 seconds. And if you feel it, any pain or discomfort, um, you may want to seek medical attention. But also just to breathe in terms of listen, though we've never seen something like COVID before in our lifetime here, um, dramatic things and pandemics have happened. Um, during the time of the market. And for different people, they mean different things. But the worst thing that you can do is be reactive instead of proactive. So just take some time to breathe. Deep breaths in, long deep breaths out, so you can properly assess what it is that you need to be doing. So that you can think clearly, that's one. Uh, budget. <clears throat> I know it sounds as simple as it may be, um, okay, I, what, how's a budget going to help me? What does that mean? Well, uh, a budget is more important now than ever. Uh, a lot of people have been facing um, difficulties in terms of employment. Some people have been furloughed. Um, so income has changed. So the best thing that you can do when there's a possibility that your income may be going down and, and your expenses may be increasing, the best thing that you can do is really solidify that budget. Um, and sometimes automation is kind of the best thing for that. I tell people some of my, some personal budgeting apps that I use for myself. I use um, an app called Mint, M-I-N-T. That's made by uh, Intuit, the same people that make uh, TurboTax. They also make an app called uh, Mint, where you can put all of your accounts in and it'll give you graphs and charts to kind of show you where your money is spending and it kind of electronically, uh, you can set budgets and, and margins for yourself and when you get close to hitting those you can make your settings as to where it'll send you a message or a text or an email just saying hey you're this close to this budget but why that's so important is because to be in full control of your finances you have to know what's going in and what's coming out um the, the biggest detriment you can do to yourself right now is to have a shift in something and not have a plan for exactly how much you can spend if you're getting unemployment benefits, see exactly what those benefits are, and we work your budget to them. See what what can kind of give and what can take in, in terms of these things. Or if you've worked out some kind of arrangements on your mortgage or things like that, make sure to incorporate those changes, even though temporary, into your budget. And, um, and thirdly, uh, to balance, to balance those things. Go through your checkbook to make sure that all the numbers do add up. You should have a flat balance to zero. Everything that's come out should match your records, keeping a record of what you're spending and part of what your budget helps to create the balance so that all the income and all the expenses that you have, they should all line up. If you see something that's out of whack, you say, well, I only spent so much and it's saying that I spent this off. Go back through your electronic bank records. If you, any bank that you should be with at the time, even if you get paper statements, there should still be e statement available for you online. So go and check those. And a lot of times, even the paper copies, have what's an old school balance ledger on the back so you can write in all of your expenses. Um, can it be kind of tedious at times? Yes. Is it worth doing in terms of having record of what went on? Absolutely. And just those kind of three simple things will kind of give you a peace of mind into how to proceed and what's going on. So those are kind of the first, the three Bs. Breathe, budget, and balance. Just to kind of get yourself back to a square one.